What's going on everybody? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tay. Nice to meet you. And if you have not yet subscribed, baby girl, baby girl, baby girl, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you really doing? But before you subscribe, you can get to know me a little bit more by watching my other videos. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be explaining a few ways to start your natural hair page on Instagram. I am a natural hair influencer and I started my page the last week of May 2020. It was quarantine, so I didn't really have anything to do. I was not working. So I'm like, I love doing hair. I might as well start a hair page. So before we get into anything, go follow my hair page on Instagram at Hairstyles with Tay. I'll try to put it on the screen. First, you wanna create your name. You wanna come up with a unique name, something that's never heard before. I came up with Hairstyles with Tay because like, it's basic because a lot of people have it, but I wasn't really thinking. I'm helping you guys not make the same mistake that I did. So it's basically the same thing as coming up with a YouTube name. If I were to change my name right now, it would be, let me think of one. Wow. Before you make your Instagram page, come up with a bunch of hair styles. I mean, a notebook full of hairstyles. Do not, do not, do not. Don't make your page yet. Come up with a bunch of hairstyles. Find different hair influencers, hairstyles that you can mimic, which is called Inspired By. After you've found all of the hair influencers, hairstyles that you want to recreate, now you can go ahead and actually make the Instagram page. After you make your Instagram page now, you want to put your page, one, don't put it to private. You will get no followings, you will get no views, you will get no support, you will not be on the explore page, you will not succeed. Just saying, just that's it. You won't succeed, sorry. After you made your page a business page and not just a regular Instagram page, your page is not on private, you made your page, you got your hairstyles and all of that, now you can go ahead and make your video. When you're starting and you're making a video, you wanna make sure you bundle record hairstyles. Now I know it's a lot of hair manipulation going on and everything, but baby girl, try your best to go from non-gel styles all the way to gel styles because if you start with a gel style, you can't do anything after that because your hair is paced down. What? you're gonna have to it's just gonna be a hot mess basically you can record up to five videos and you want to edit it and everything also make sure you put your name tag on the video just just in case because people do still videos i don't know why but they still videos so make sure you have your name tag on the bottom of the video side of the video don't put it in the middle because that's a distraction the top like any and like the perimeter of the video basically after you post your video, you want to make sure you do hashtags. Hashtag, hashtag. So you can do hashtag explore page, hashtag trending, hashtag natural hairstyles, hashtag um, hairstyle community, hashtag, hashtag, whatever your hair type is, hashtag whatever products you used, hashtag every hashtag that you could think of that relates to natural hair, hashtag it. I don't know how many tips I gave up. I think I gave like three or four, I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna make a part two. This was like a mini short video. I hope this really helped you guys out. And I hope you guys start your natural hair page now and don't start later because now is the right time. Now is the right time. So start now. And when you do start, make sure you comment what your natural hair page is below so I can go check you and your videos out. And without further ado, I think it's time to end this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this little short video, make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you will be notified anytime I post a new video. Bye.